Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Stubby Compact, back with another GTA 5 glitch video. Today I'm going to be showing you a fun and easy little way to speed glitch your car. And this will keep it speed glitch during the whole session until you change your session. So this will work even if you step out of your vehicle, um, as long as you don't send it back. If you step out of your vehicle and get back into it, it will still be speed glitched through the whole session. And this will work on any vehicle. Any vehicle besides a flying vehicle. You cannot use your flying vehicles for this to work. Um, but it will work on any land vehicle, any moped, anything. You can go deliver those pizzas super quick now. So you can use this to help you deliver pizzas super quick. It will stay glitched out the whole session. First thing you're gonna wanna do, um, I'm gonna show you real quick that this will work. Give you a little demo. So here you go. We'll start off right here. Go ahead and make my view in here and you will see that it will only reach about 150 without being glitched out. And as you see, it's climbing super slow. I mean, we're only hitting 140 right now. Maybe 150 by the time this is done. Not even 150. All right, so you've seen we didn't even hit 150, and it took a long time to get there. Well, we're about to change that right now. We're going to make this super quick. Now, when you come up to your hangar, you're going to kind of have to get a feel for where you um, spawn out of your hangar. So, like, you're going to have to run, run in your hangar on foot, and then when you come back out, see where your guy spawns because that's where you're going to want to park your car um where your guy can get to it in a quick hurry so we're going to leave mine about right here this is about where mine's usually at right in here somewhere so once i do that i'm just going to go ahead and run inside So you're just gonna have to do that a few times to make sure you kind of get a feel for where you spawn outside. Because you're gonna need to be spamming the triangle button. So okay, so now that I'm inside, I'm gonna go back outside. Exit, I'm spamming triangle, spamming triangle, just like that. You can see my guy running towards the car, that means it worked. If your guy's running towards it, it worked. Now we're gonna take you over here real quick and I will show you that this works. All right, so you've seen before, it was only about 150. We're about to hit that real quick, plus some. As you can see, the speed's already at 150, 160. Look, it's already almost at 200. And that's all that to go, but I'm still going. This car's got a lot more in it. It's just the speed tack won't let it go any faster, but you see how quick that was. So let's do it again. Boom, you just see that thing climb and it's already maxed out almost. Yeah, just like that. You can do this with any vehicle, the Pizza Boy, um, anything. And I will show you that it will stay glitched out. Let me turn it around real quick. Now I can go ahead and get out. I'll get back in. And it'll still be glitched out. Look how fast that thing is. We're already maxed out. And it's still going faster. We ain't even in the last gear yet. Yeah, that thing had a lot left there. You can just see this thing just all over the place. So yeah, it's just a fun little glitch to go mess around with. And as long as you stay in the session and don't switch vehicles, it will stay glitched out. And like I said, you can do this with any land vehicle. So it's just something fun to go play around. Um, go deliver some pizzas with it. That's what I would do. Go get that XP. I mean that RP. Some money. Go deliver those pizzas super quick. So if you like what you've seen, please like and subscribe and I'll be back with some more GTA 5 content.